Hey there, this is Kevin. I've got some exciting news for you today. I have a new threaded barrel trailblazer life card. And here we go. So this threaded barrel life card, I'm absolutely excited about. It's probably one of the simplest designs. Really, really solid weapon. Check that out. We have our integrated threaded barrel. This mechanism right here is the release to open it up. Now I've got it opened up in the lock position. The second mechanism here will actually tilt forward the barrel. So if I pop this guy backwards, I can pull the barrel forward and be able to load my single round into there. Threaded barrel. There's a compartment right here in the back side of this that will hold three additional rounds. All right. Do not pull this thing all the way. There's some small pieces in there that come apart. You just open that just that far to be able to dump out some spare rounds. Okay. So I made that mistake already. There's some very small spring and a piece in there. So I've got my components, got the smaller piston in there, and I can be able to reload this weapon. Okay. Threaded barrel. The only other major action of this is this right here. I can pull this back. You notice the trigger mechanism move. There we go. Now it's cocked. Assuming I had a round in here, this would actually be ready to fire. As I do not, it's not going to fire. But very exciting stuff. Okay. Naturally, threaded barrel. So we're going to have to get into that, get some suppressors on it. The life card's been super popular with the GSL Pillbox 22 suppressor. I'm going to show you. I'm going to show you this weapon with a couple different suppressors. The first of which is the Woodland for 22, which is about the same length. All right, it's exactly five inches long. And so we'll fire that first because this is the top selling model in our product line. This is the most universal that you're going to see guys shooting your Mark IVs and your 22s and your 1022s with. So we'll fire that one first because that's going to give us our maximum sound reduction. We've got a couple other models. Right, this media, this medium one here you'll see is called the flea. And obviously you're probably pretty familiar with the GSL pillbox 22. So I'll fire all three of these so we can hear the sound difference between these and make it happen. Let's go to the range. All right, I figured I'd film the entire reloading procedure for you. This is slightly faster than reloading a muzzle loader. <laughs> so I'm gonna pull forward on this mechanism here to drop the barrel. All right, I'm gonna pull out the old round, like so. Drop in a new round. These are my CCI quiets. Let's see how those do. And then close the action. Pull back on this little, there we go. And I'm ready to fire. Wicked, wicked cool. Love it, love it. This is, um, yeah, pretty solid. So I'm kind of siding down the suppressor actually, down the barrel of the weapon, but wicked cool. Let's hear another one. My little cartridge reservoir here. Pop forward on this choker. Drop around in, close, cock it, and we're ready to fire. Let's get a little closer. Very cool. So, I realized that I never actually got to my final thoughts on the Trailblazer lifeguard. That is an awesome weapon. It's a lot of fun to shoot, right? It's not one you're going to uh, shoot a thousand rounds through at the range, but it is a really cool backup everyday carry gun, right? I'd highly recommend them. I'd definitely buy one. Good fun. You can check them out at Palmetto State. I've got a couple links here in the, uh, in the review and 
check them out. Get yourself one. Get with your FFL. Yeah. Have an awesome day.